Don't forget guys, my Craft City product is now at Walmart. We are at Target still, but we are also at other stores and we are now at Walmart with mystery slime packs and craft kits. So head to Walmart and snatch your slime. I can't wait to see all of your creations. Make sure to tag me on Instagram at Craft City Life and at Karina Garcia. I am here at the grocery store. <laughs> It's cold. And honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I like rarely go to these stores because aren't they usually like a little more expensive? In a way. Everything here is like so organic and there's so many vegan options. So I knew I had to come here. I'm gonna try to find some meat substitutes. I'm gonna explore, see what I can get and get my day started being vegan. I found some vegan pizza. This one looks like it has like fake meat on it. It looks really good. And and the produce section. This is all vegan, obviously. Cheddar bunnies? Yeah, cheddar bunnies. Are they real bunnies? Oh, they're stupid. vegan. Wait, they're Super vegan? Super organic. It's organic and vegan is different, bro. Oh, I have I quickly learned that everything vegan actually has a little thing on it. It's a heart with a V. And oh, that's when you know it's I vegan. See. Okay. And that's a wrap. I got a lot of options, okay? I'm excited to show Elizabeth what I got. Ah! Elizabeth is finally here. Hi. <laughs> so it's about 5 p.m. and I am starving. I am so hungry. First of all, okay, I went to the store. Have you ate before this? I'm so hungry. Well, I started off with some vegan snacks. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Wait, no, I actually had a, a burger for my job. Like how long ago? Like, <laughs> like an hour ago. Mm -hmm. Elizabeth, I called you. I said we were gonna eat. Sister! Okay, so, starting right now, like we're vegan. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you never know after at least 24 hours. Maybe we like it. The food. <laughs> I feel like there's certain foods that I can stop eating. Like I can stop eating pork. I can stop eating like red meat. But I feel like I would never actually let go of everything. I look up to vegans. Like I think it's yeah, like admirable. Really it's admirable. I wish I had the willpower to do it. I know it's healthier. I know that you know. Obviously, like the cruelty to animals. Even as meat eaters, like, you know the reality, and it's the saddest thing ever. And of course, like the environment and everything too. You know what? Me and Elizabeth are giving it a shot today. We don't know anything about it, so I feel like that's why we're so exactly like, negative People, about it. Me I think it's gonna be fun to go and try different foods and like like things that stuff to everything that yeah. we eat on a regular basis. Maybe it so could be a possibility. maybe it's a possibility in the future. You never know. You never know, sis. I mean, obviously, this is only 24 hours. It's not gonna be realistically like our body's not gonna feel a huge difference so I know you're probably thinking like 24 hours but this is just us opening up our mind to this trying it Something out new. learning a lot educating of things. ourselves about what being vegan really is because we really don't know and what we're it. gonna put in our body and where it's coming from comment down below some positive comments to encourage us to maybe like actually do this. Yeah, forever. Or for a Is while. there any vegans watching? Comment down below any tips or tricks. Please. Because I actually like the idea of exploring this, even if it's just for a day. I got us snacks and everything because I know we need our snacks. We're like, me and Karina like love to snack. I got cookies, girl. And it's also deeper than food. It's not just food, you know? Like it's the makeup we're wearing. Like, it, like, is all your makeup cruelty free? Is oh what everything gosh. you're wearing cruelty free? Are your shoes, what are you wearing right now? <laughs> I'm wearing boots. Are they leather? <laughs> Wait, are they leather or are they? I think they look leather, but I don't think they're real leather. Wait. Oh, okay. What? Aren't shirts <laughs> real leather? No, they're just flip flops. They're Gucci flip flops. I think are they, they are leather. leather. <laughs> Leather? You oh my God. are starting off the wrong foot, Missy. Oh my God, wait, I'm gonna take them off. <laughs> so I got some fruit, and uh, I got some chia seeds, I got oats, I got almond milk, I got a bunch of stuff, but this right here is actually for breakfast that we're gonna prep for tomorrow. I got some chips. This one is actually what you would call like hot Cheetos, but vegan, kind of, because they're spicy. <laughs> Hopefully they're as good, because we need our hot Cheetos. So this is, uh, this is like a granola, it sprouts, it's like seeds basically, and it tastes like bacon. I got some cookies, vegan cookies. Karina, these look like cookies. I know, no, they're bomb. I've tasted vegan cookies before. They're actually my favorite type of cookies. Yeah, and they really are chocolate chip. If you have a stuff, it's very easy to just like replace the dairy products with like other stuff. Like, you can replace like eggs with applesauce and stuff. It's complicated, but the whole world, like with dude. baking. I got dry fruit slices. It's kind of like fruit roll-ups. Okay. I thought that would be bomb. That's delicious. So. I got some vegan ranch because I know it's you need a ranch. It's necessary, <laughs> yes. I'm so hungry. This is just the beginning. I actually got some pizza for us to make. Vegan pizza. Vegan pizza? Sister? Ooh, so, with ranch. So we got 
two different kinds of pizza. They both have cheese on them. Okay. This one is basically just cheese and mushrooms. Okay. You know me, I hate mushrooms. But this one has fake meat on it, so okay. I feel like I'm gonna I'll take this like, one. I'm just gonna <laughs> I'll try both, but I feel like I'm like this. I'll just take the mushrooms off of this. I also got, surprise, I got some miniature corn dogs. With, like they're, Okay, sister, now we're talking. And some buffalo wings, and it's all vegan. I don't know how the heck they do it, but <laughs> thank you. Wait, Last but definitely what? not least. These look like legit, Karina. I also got a vegan chocolate cake. Sister! I mean, I couldn't understand how they make these taste like meat, but I still don't understand how they do the, ch the cheese. Cheers to us exploring and possibly turning into vegan. I'm dead, honestly, I'm excited. All right. It's ready, sis. I'm I don't so have excited. A, I don't have one of those pizza roller cutter thingies. Okay, the crust is definitely cardboard. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What are you doing? I love how you successfully avoided all of the mushrooms. Yeah. yeah. Cheers to the vegan life. Okay. I don't like the mushrooms. But I really want to try mm. the fake meat. The cheese is not bad. Whatever it is. Taste the meat. Oh my god, I hate the sausage. For the first time in my life, I can't eat a sausage. It's good when it's on the pizza, but alone, though. No. <laughs> I would eat this again. I would eat mine again. The thing is, with vegan meat substitutes, it's a hit or miss. I've tried some that's really bomb. You know what I mean? And this one's like not it, sis. Even the mushroom, I, maybe because it's frozen or something. I don't know, but I don't like it. It's just, it's the fact that it's frozen. The sausage definitely is a no for me. But the actual pizza without the sausage is not bad. Uh, I, mm. It's all right. Should we get cakes? Because I'm not great. Yeah. I want to try the cake. <laughs> it smells amazing, Elizabeth. Mm. Can I see, bro? Wait, why is it so hard? Why is it cardboard? It's actually really stiff. I don't know if it's supposed to be that. Nice. It tastes like stale cake. I like it. I like it a lot. I thought it was gonna be softer. It's good. Like if I had to eat it, I would. I don't think it's bad. But it wouldn't make me crave cake like I, think I do. It tastes like cake though. It does taste like cake. Mm -hmm. Sister, I think we should go vegan. <laughs> We're gonna make our breakfast for tomorrow, uh, so it's basically, it's berry cobbler overnight oats. We, we have everything we need, it's only five minute prep, which is actually amazing. So we need a half a cup of gluten-free rolled oats. So basically a full cup, because it's the both of us. Mm -hmm. So okay. we're gonna use half a cup in each jar. Girl, just dump it in there. Okay, are we good? That looks pretty portioned, right? And we have hemp seeds, so we're actually gonna split these between the two of us. Okay. Okay, it feels like seed. <laughs> One tablespoon of chia seeds. Okay. I Tablespoon. love chia seeds, guys. Oh my gosh. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. Oh my god, this actually sounds bomb. Yeah, I'm excited. Oh snap! I'm it already messing delicious. up. delicious. Huh? Two tablespoons of sugar. Okay. Okay. Two. Yep. Okay, just One. dump it all in there. A fourth of a ripe banana, mashed. Or half, doesn't matter, huh? So we don't waste a banana. Yeah, let's just split it. We love a mashed banana queen. <laughs> Is the sugar down there? Lord, please. <laughs> <laughs> I love how we're like, well, we can't eat animal products, but let's eat 30 pounds of sugar. <laughs> Next up is strawberries and some berries. I think you should do cubes instead of slices. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. presentation. And <laughs> presentation? Yeah, I want it to look, look pretty when I eat it. <laughs> Dang, one strawberry? Okay, thickums. Mm. Ooh, and then some I berries. I love fruit, Karina. You know I love fruit. Mm -hmm. And it's obviously dumb. <laughs> I'm sorry. We stand some berries. Last but not least, almond milk because regular milk is dairy. Duh. Look, it's rising. Oh, it goes sinking. all the way down. Okay, okay. You know how it's like sinking? It's mm -hmm. gonna, it's going down. So let's shake it up, and then we'll add more milk. I agree. All right, ready? We have chunks. It's like cereal. It's actually right now. It looks mm. like that, but what's gonna okay. happen is the oats are gonna absorb the milk overnight, and it's gonna be like a parfait type of thing. Okay, it's sweet as hell in here. <laughs> <laughs> we stand carbs. Wow, they look so much like Hot Cheetos. This is the first one that 
I really don't like. I'd rather not eat chips. I just feel like I need to try something good tomorrow because it's already nighttime and I'm getting tired and I'm still hungry because like I didn't want to eat the pizza because it was frozen and it wasn't that good. The chocolate cake I wasn't like obsessed with but it was good. I hate this. I want something that I want I want to enjoy something. I really actually like the Starbucks coffee. <laughs> well it's just coconut milk it's not like anything drastic. <laughs> I know but I'm glad that there's something good. Oh you know what the difference is? This is not the whipped cream. I just noticed that. Yeah, and see that's like makes it thicker and stuff. Good morning everybody. Like How are you? How are you guys? We are alive. We and are vegan. <laughs> <laughs> guys, so I lost 20 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> no, you look so, your makeup looks amazing. Really? We did our makeup like in literally like 25 minutes and look okay. at Elizabeth. We have our oats ready, the overnight oats. We have to shake them, right? Yeah, I have to like shake them. Oh my god, I almost dropped this. Go in, sis. No fears. Okay, it's not horrible. I can tell. I love it. I actually don't mind it cold. It's oatmeal. It's just like cold oatmeal. And this is a lot. Like, this is gonna fill I feel us like up. I'm so used to the texture because my mom makes oatmeal like this. I feel like it'd be good hot, but this is giving me, this is giving me cereal vibes. If you put it less sugar, it still tastes delicious. Mm -hmm. I feel like the fruit, the chunks, it's like really good. I want chicken wings so bad, like actual real chicken wings. I've been craving them all freaking night. It hasn't even been like nowhere near 24 hours. I mean, it's been, we started like at 5 p.m. It's 10 a.m. But I am craving meat so bad. And with keto, it's so you much deeper than food though. Like I'm starting to realize how many things I have. My lashes, I couldn't wear them. Most of my makeup is cruelty free. Karina, don't tell me you don't want the girl in front of you with some real sausage. I do, 100%. We have some corn dogs, which I'm really excited to try because mm. they're vegan. Oh, do you God. want some corn dogs? I'm gonna put this in the microwave, and then we all should we should also put the wings in there. We're going again. Okay, let me put it in a bowl. Same. I I changed too. I was like so tired. So this they're called Ruffalo wings. Hilarious. They actually look like this. Of? I want Chubs to try the vegan food. I don't know, sis. This looks a little weird. That smells so good, Elizabeth. Yeah, it does. Maybe this is the first bomb one we're gonna eat. Vegan baby sisters. It's okay. Look at Chubs. Look at his face. It's hot. It's okay. It's okay. It's chewy. They're good. You know when you get a bad aftertaste? This gets the bad taste right away. But like the aftertaste is good. Doesn't it have a weird taste at first and then it tastes good? <laughs> I can't stand how chewy it is. Now the chicken wings, honey. Can't forget the ranch, vegan ranch. Is that good? I'd rather have chicken wings than that. Oh, really? Can I try it? Surprisingly. It's like. <laughs> I tried the cookies. We haven't tried the cookies yet. Yeah. Cheers. These are good. Mm -hmm. I feel like sweet stuff, vegan sweet stuff, is like bomb. It comes to the. Meat substitutes that I don't like. I'd rather eat a salad with nothing on it. We need this. We haven't tried the ba um, the bacon tasting sprouts. Open them up. I feel like this just turned into just trying vegan stuff instead of, well, you know, no, there is some changes that you feel, not physically, but you notice so many things like some of my shoes, your handbags, or just anything like a glass of milk, obviously you cheese, your makeup. You just realize that there's so many animal products around you. I don't taste the bacon at all. More like seeds. Sorry. They're good, there's just not absolutely no bacon flavor. It says that it's supposed to taste like bacon, but it doesn't. We're actually an hour over already. There's so many animal products around you and the fact that you stay committed. And you guys are helping the environment and animal, animal cruelty is admirable. I might look into it in the future, not gonna lie. It I was think very I, be I could become, um, I, I feel like with the process, with time and commitment, it could become like a lifestyle. For it was sure. definitely very eye-opening. Way better than the living. Okay guys, it is a different day 
but we really wanted to try some bomb vegan food. Oh my God, it's like a mukbang, a vegan mukbang! <laughs> I don't know about you, girl, but like, I actually am more open to the whole vegan thing. I am too. It's hard over there where we live. We, we're actually in LA right now in my LA space. And I feel like back home, it's really hard to find vegan restaurants. And here, they're everywhere. They're everywhere. So I feel like it would kind of be easier to be vegan in LA. Like when we did this, we I feel like all the food we got, <laughs> since it was frozen, it was, it was nasty. But this, from an actual restaurant, like it tastes real. Yeah, it does. I wouldn't even know this is vegan. This is not bad. Bomb, Elizabeth. This pizza is from Mohawk Ben. And I think I'm gonna eat this again, vegan or not. <laughs> I'm gonna be real with y'all. I don't know if I see myself going vegan anytime soon, but maybe I'll look into it later. I'm glad that I learned more about it and stuff. We're more educated about but I, it. But either way, regardless, I think I would actually order this again. I like the cheese a lot. It's really good. Even I the tomato basil, it's so good. I think I would crave the cheese so much that it would make me order this again. <coughs> So we got our vegan burger. It was called kale something burger. <laughs> this patty is stiff. Yeah, I did. I think they, they oh tried to make it look like a patty, but it doesn't feel like a patty. It's made from falafel. So they just like season it. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God, that's crazy. Okay. I don't want to be disappointed. It's good. Your face looks like you like it. Elizabeth, you're gonna love it. If I'm vegan and I'm really craving my burger, I would totally enjoy that. So it's a lawful meat patty, <laughs> uh, purple cabbage, which is really good. So good. Sweden huh? grilled onions. Mm. Some kind of dressing. I can't. Oh my god, is that avocado? Oh lord Jesus. But you liked it. Oh god. Elizabeth, I just ate avocado. avocado, guys. The burger is from Fallibor. Cauliflower chicken wings. <laughs> well, they're not chicken. I'm sorry. Oh my god. Buffalo, Buffalo cauliflower, cauliflower wings. They're just gonna. <laughs> There's no wing. <laughs> 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 like, like all the fried part came out of it. This is actually good. Real yeah. coconut sandwich, and it says vegan. We know the Oreo is gonna taste like Oreo, cause isn't that vegan? Oh yeah. I am so excited, Elizabeth. These Do you look believe amazing. it now? Do you I see sandwich. that? Like, Hurry up, cause I'm about to die. Yeah. <laughs> I want to try it. Mmm. I usually don't like coconut, but this is amazing. Mmm, this is so good. Mm. I love that this is not too sweet. It's like perfect. It's from Yogurt Stop. This is way better than the frozen food, but I feel like obviously we can't get a real sense of what it's like to be vegan because it's 24 hours and there's not gonna be any drastic changes in 24 hours. It's just, you just realize how many things Options. you're using on, in, on the daily that are not vegan not just food wise like what your makeup what you're wearing just a lot of things that you don't even think about dude well but it was a great experience understanding like the vegan world or kind of like even just understanding it a little bit more than what we really like did I we have like no idea what it was this goes to show that this food is actually good because we took a few bites and everybody's passing eating. around the food eating it it's good. We're glad that we tried it. We're not judging anybody who is vegan and who can do this. If anything, we respect I you guys. I admire, admire that. you guys. We love the reasons also why you guys are vegan yeah. and not just about, you know, Dude. what everybody thinks, which is just like not eating meat. There's other, you know, reasons. There's, yeah. It's a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle. Cruelty and everything. I feel like before this experience no. would have been an instant no. But now that we've tried different things, like the pizza and all that, we have different options and we would totally eat it. It really makes you think a little bit more about what you're eating, what you're putting into your body. What are you um, putting on your face? Yeah. We did throw out a lot of stuff. Where it's coming from and stuff. A lot of things that we don't even think about because they're just so... They're not part of a routine, you know? And they're so normal to us, it's but crazy, like... crazy, dude. You could go and make a change or even like make a difference by even getting a different brand of makeup. You never know, you know? It definitely makes you think when you order your next meal, if there's an option to go the other, you know... The other route, yeah. Yeah, it definitely makes you conscious of that. Comment down below if, you know, you have any of your favorite vegan... Recipes. recipes comment down below any tips and tricks that you would have for us like if we wanted to look more into it and actually being vegan and stuff i don't know and we're interested in knowing more so comment down below i just want to say if you guys do have an opportunity to look into it and to do some research and even be more educated about it you don't have to turn vegan but like at least you know educate yourself about it the products all that is very interesting and i think you guys would learn something out of it but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video comment down below any other future videos that you want to see let me know if you want to see elizabeth more in my videos 
Of course they do. I cry. Hashtag, Hashtag Team Elizabeth. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, Bye guys. Team Elizabeth. Hashtag Team Peter. Six feet under. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>